Royal commentator Alison Boshoff has spoken out regarding Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, claiming that pair have allegedly been put on ice in terms of their future career prospects. Boshoff has said that the Duke and Duchess of Sussex once hoped to become a global humanitarian power couple, but these ambitions are looking less likely, especially with Hollywood elites freezing them out. Boshoff told the Daily Mail, Meghan, the ink fresh on her management deal with the ultimate Hollywood agent, Ari Emanuel at WME, is still pursuing creative and commercial opportunities. It was a solo deal not her and Harry and an enormous coup. Speaking of the Duke of Sussex, the royal expert claimed that Harry could be taking a slightly different venture. She said, Harry, meanwhile, is said to be gravitating back to charity and campaigning work, planning a return to Africa to film a documentary following in the footsteps of his mother a venture that will see him travelling to the continent alone. She said, their ambition to become a global humanitarian power couple seems, for the moment at least, to be on ice. It was confirmed last month that the couple's £15 million deal with Spotify had come to an end after just over two years, with only one podcast series coming from the deal. The decision was mutually agreed between the pair and the company, with a joint statement released to confirm the news. Speaking exclusively to Express.co.uk, PR expert and GUP's chief executive Edward Coram James has said that he does not believe the termination of the contract will harm Harry and Meghan's careers, although it could affect the types of deals they will get. https//www.mirror.co.uk slash news slash UK news slash ask 20 protesters Yukup conference 6520395 M.R. Coram James said, the end of their Spatifa deal does not mean that they will not get future deals. What it means is that these deals are likely to be of a much lower value, and are potentially less likely to be centered around the Sussexes producing visual or audio content. Concluding, he added that the pair cannot afford another dud or cancellation. Despite the cancellation, the pair still hold multi-million pound deals with Netflix and Penguin Random House.